Hello, my name is Mark Blocker, and in this segment we're going to cover what do the numbers on a tire mean? Okay, here I've got a tire, and as you can see, there's several sets of numbers on the tire, and all three sets of them have different meanings. Here we have a RE950 number, and that's the model number of this specific type of tire. Over here, we have the actual tire size numbers, and these are the ones that are important. It starts off with a P185, and that 185 is the overall width of the tire. And they can range anywhere from a 165 up to a 225, 35, 45. The higher the number, the wider and larger tread width the tire is going to have. The next number you shows on there is a slash 60. And that 60 is the series height of the tire, how much tread sidewall it's going to have. The lower the number, the shorter the sidewall, and the higher number, the higher the sidewall. So you might have somewhere between a 40 series on up to a 70, 75, or 80 series tire. The higher the number, the taller the sidewall is. The next number is the R14 number, and that's the actual opening of the tire itself, the rim size that it's mounted to. So this would be a 185, 60 series R14 tire. 14 being the rim height of the tire, the 60 series is the height of the sidewall, and the 185 being the overall width of the tire compound, or the tread width. You'll also see one other number, and it's stated DOT, and then it's got a number on there. And what that is is a Department of Transportation Safety number, and that won't have any, uh, really doesn't pertain to anything that we need to know. So that's what the numbers on the side of a tire mean.